Hi guys, welcome to week 12. Um, this week we're going to be working on the differences between predictive writing and persuasive writing. So we have a couple of chapters to read, one in Hamies and one in Stasky. We have uh, a PowerPoint. We have a video lecture, just I say class 11, but it's class 12. Sorry about that. We have a Kelly lesson on uh, ethical considerations for writing a memo. And then we have the meeting with me. So if you didn't sign up for your meeting last week, sign up now, April 14th. If for some reason you can't make it on April 14th, please reach out to me so we can set up a different mutually convenient time. Um, here's the directions for meeting me. We are doing this on Blackboard Collaborate Ultra. You go to tools, where is that? Tools communication. <laughs> Here it is. Click on Blackboard Collaborate Ultra. You click on the little door up here that tells us to join the course room. Then you click on join the course room and turn on your mic so we can chat. Okay. So that is that. Um, so if you don't do that, I'm not going to give you any credit for <laughs> your work in on, um, homework 11 with the issues, because it's really about making sure your issues are right. So you're not spinning your wheels when you are working on your final project. So then, and there's a Cali, I told you there's a Cali lesson. So for your assignments, you have a quiz, you have the Cali lesson and the, okay. So there's a memo that your final project, and then your final homework is to, um, create an outline for your final project. So we're moving right along. So work on that after we talk about the issues. Now, when you're doing your issues and you're doing your outline, I've given you under course materials, I've given you cases and statutes to look through. You don't have to use them all. You don't have to, um, you can use ones that aren't in there, but this is a way for you to start. And I would recommend that you read through these cases so that when you look through the cases, you'll be able to spot issues in your own project. Okay. So that's it. And I will chat with you in the main lecture.